Every child, every brother Let's call it in the crossfire Let's call it in the crossfire Hello everyone, Jason Leia back here again, and today we will be reviewing the action attack Sukumimus from the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom toy line. Now, I know I haven't done a video like this in quite a while, but I feel like it's time now that Wave 3 has arrived, new figures are out finally, and now I'll be able to review them. So, here we go. So we got the basic box art of the volcano, we got the logo, Owen in blue, how to do the figure, already got the figure opened, back tells you how to do everything, different design, paint job, um, I already reviewed these dinosaurs, they're the Jurassic World app, blah blah blah, let's get into the figure. Now, it stands, it stands very well. And I love it. It I love the colors also. The basic swamp look. It is much more darker than the leaked photos seem to present it. But I really like that. And it just looks much more natural like a dinosaur. I love the detailing on the skin and everywhere also. It is... Hold on. Yeah. It is really... It is really cool to see all these scales and different details the design go through the figure, especially in the feet. I love, I also love how there's a bit of dark green, that's like a swamp color in the back, and the spines also, and that eye, oh my god, it looks amazing, and the head sculpt is fantastic too. It reminds me a lot of the Spinosaurus and Baryonyx, and I really like that about this figure. It is really cool in design. I also love the paint job, how it fades slowly, darker once you go down to the lower legs. And it just looks much more better than the actual leaked photos, honestly. The only thing that's not painted are the hand claws, but I could forgive it. But paint job is great. I love the detailing and the tail also. If I were to have a gripe is that the tail could have been a little longer. Honestly, I felt like this is pretty much a pretty short tail. But it's detailed and good enough it poses at least. So that's good. It stands very well. So, yeah, there isn't much to complain here. So, the basic action feature is the you press the button down here and it will chomp down. Um, I will say that the mount, look at it again, the under jaw right here looks a little too thin, like it could break. But I really like the action feature. It looks really cool. And you could bob its head. Make it sing. Y-M-C-A. <laughs> but, yeah. Overall, this ain't that bad a figure. This was honestly a surprise. I honestly love it. The action feature really good. The design and detailing is really good. The paint job is much more natural. The posability is there. And it works really well on its own. And I could overall recommend it. It is pretty much a surprising 9 out of 10 for me. Only problem is that the tail is a little short. And the mouth I feel like is a little... The under jaw is too thin. But... Overall, I would highly recommend you guys go get this figure when you can. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time. So heaven if you sent us down So we can build a play go round For the sinners to play a